what we do here is go back, 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 back. back. What's up? What's going on? Chase Jacobs here. Oh, yeah, we got us a jar here. Let's do some old school jar poetry. So let's jump on in and see what the universe has for today. Just a little something, just a little nudge to help us raise up our vibrations so we can have a much better day. All right, let's just pull one out. Let's select one. Got one right here. Set down the old jar. Let's do a little, you know what it is, a little... Greco, Greco. Let's see what we got here. This one is what's soon to be. Oh, more work inspired by Abraham X. What's soon to be. I, I accept my responsibility. I'm staking my claim. I'm the creator of my joy. Armed with smiles in my game. I'm bonded to my source. The non-physical me, my soul and self-love partner. In alignment I will be. Asking you shall receive. Many have found this to be true. Focus on what you want. Vibrations attracted to you. I'm mindful of what I think about. My thoughts are rewarding me. A buffer of what my future holds. A vortex of what's soon to be. Oh yeah, what is up? What's going on? Chase Jacobs here doing a little of this old school jar poetry. I, you know, I used to do this all the time back in the day. I always pulled some out of the jar out in here, but you know what? You know, it was just time to venture outside the office and get out on the road. So most, a lot of times I'm doing it in the car these days, but it's all good. The point is just showing up, right? Showing up, each of us has to make up our mind of what we want to do and how we want to utilize our spare time when we're not doing other things, right? What do you want to do with your time? And so I find that, man, I, just, I love talking to you. And I like, uh, you know, grabbing a little rhyme and then just seeing what flows out of my mouth. And there you go. <laughs> Good times there. So like I mentioned earlier, this, this one that I just did was inspired by Abraham Hicks. I love the work that Esther Hicks does. And that's, that's some pretty cool stuff that's been going on since uh, probably, what, 1986? So I like that stuff. And so, yeah, there you go right there. It's all about thinking each day of what do you want to throw up on your grid, right? What are things that you want, right? And pre-paving, right? Putting it in motion, getting those things in motion. Thinking, thinking about the right thought to think about. <laughs> Get it in motion, right? <laughs> Get those vibrations in motion. And uh, yeah, so that's all all good. And meanwhile, that that vortex is just collecting all of those. Woohoo! Yeah. So anyway, uh, hey, I just thought of um, man, I really love Sedona, Arizona. I don't know why I just thought of that. Maybe because we said vortex. And so, put down in the comments. Have you been to Sedona, Arizona? Let me know. I know eventually I'll, I'll go back up there again this year, probably when it cools off just a little bit more. But I really love Sedona, and so I'm just curious about you. Do you like Sedona, Arizona? Tell me something down in the comments. All right, I'm going to keep this one short today. I hope you're having a great weekend. I'm Jace Jacobs. Appreciate everything. Love fully. Need nothing. Namaste, my friend. High five, Knuckles. Let us. Seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. You'll never have the sacred stone. <laughs> oh, this you crazy mother.